Hey everybody, I'm Carl, I'm to Ecuador, and today I'm in Antwerp at Amoras and this looks like a bridge for pedestrians, but it isn't. I will show you what's going on over there. So I'm standing here with Robbie, an engineer from Amoros, and we're standing on a bridge. And Robbie, can you tell us what is this all about? Well, uh, the Amoras project is a project for the Flemish government. Uh, we recycle the sludge coming from the Antwerp Harbour. Just we pump it out of the docks over there, and then we pump it here. We let it rest for a while, and then we pump it back. So for pumping the sludge, you have two trolleys, mm -hmm. and you use our e chains. Um, what is the purpose of the e-chains? Well, the e-chain, uh, the main purpose is actually to support the hose on which we will uh, pump the sludge to our to our next facility. And you told me you haven't used something before, so it's a whole new project. It's a whole new project. This is the uh, first project of this size uh, in Europe, let's go and say. We see now the e-chain moving mm -hmm. and I can see Iglidor bearings. What is this all about? Because it's like a mixture of e-chain and bearings. Well. You can say the hose and the chain have different thermal expansion or when the hose is under pressure it expands a little um, because the hose is moving a little by, uh, by vice versa the chain mm -hmm. it has, the movement has to be uh, supported and uh, therefore the bearings are there to help the hose glide in the chain. That's the main reason yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Can you tell me how fast does it move? Well it can move up to 15 meters per minute but normally we stay uh, around 5 or 10 minutes per minute. And for how long do the e-chains run? They run now for four years. Four years without any problems? So far no problems, no. no we don't expect them either. No. Okay, very good. So uh, I think, yeah, we have a closer look and then thank you very much. Okay, you're welcome. Uh -huh. 